Hello everyone, LP here. I'm here with a new radio called the UV 5G Pro sent to me by Radio Oddity to do a fair review and look at. Um, guys, let's just get into it and go to the table. This box contains a UV 5G Pro. This UV 5G Pro is a legal GMRS handheld radio. These long-range walkie-talkies, also known as HTs, short for handheld transmitters, have all the functions of the UV5R, but transmits only on the GMRS channels. A GMRS license is required, and before all you hamheads start crying a river in the chat, this radio is Part 95E FCC certified. See that? You see it's right. You see that right there? Right there is FCC certified as a legal GMRS radio. Also, I do have a GMRS license. So, go elsewhere if you're a hamhead. And believing that only the hamhead peoples have the right to talk about radios on the interwebs. Is wrong. Now that I've done the unboxing, which is one thing I absolutely hate. The UV 5G Pro is the newer version of the GMRS version of the classic UV models. It features 20 GMRS pre-programmed channels plus 11 NOAA channels. This longer range GMRS radios are ready to go out of the box. This UG 5B Pro is re repeater capable and have eight repeater pairs pre-programmed in from channel 23 to channel 30. Channel mode. The nice thing about GMRS are their power levels and these are all wideband capable when used with a GMRS repeater. Its range is greatly increased. The radio comes with the standard BL5 1800 milliamp battery, but this radio is also compatible with all accessories from the UV5R ham radio series, such as the larger BL5L 3800 milliamp battery. This is an easy to find battery and is likely the same battery from one of your older radios. This kit comes with the standard SMAM antenna. They aren't the best antenna. There we go. Look at right. You see the letters? Uh, focus, focus, focus. I think that got it. But they will get the basic job done. The good news is that you can upgrade to a fewer different types of antennas that are also compatible with the UV5R. This radio comes with the base station type charger. It's already pre-wired for 120 and it's just got the standard function where you stick it in, the, just click it in. You can also just put the battery in by itself if you like. Obviously, we've got the handy dandy super secret CIA ear and mic. We've got our root and we've got this clip, which I'll put on here shortly. Using the NOAA feature, the radio automatically scans and receives weather reports from the channel in your area, letting you know when bad weather is coming. We all know this will be our alternate communication method during a disaster because we know that the cell towers will likely be overloaded. Looking at the display, over time, the day plays on these radios have gotten better, and this radio is easy to read with tri-color displays. Use menu function 29. This radio has all of the features that the UV5R has, and the same settings can be accessed via the menu and keypad, but that's for another video.
All right, you slackers, listen up. Did you know that we actually have a shoot, no shoot expert who's going to be speaking at Prep Stock? He's one of our lecturers, and he's going to tell us all about how to how to do the things that we're supposed to be doing lawfully with our firearms, situations, and things of that nature. So if you have got your tickets for Prep Stock 2024, Nebo, North Carolina, 12th through the 13th of October this year, the sky is not going to fall. You're going to survive. The world will continue to spin. Go get them now. Link in the description. This radio has what's called Vox. Hand hands... Hey, let's just turn that off. This radio has what's called hands-free operation, 128 channels, 50 CTCS tones, and 104 DCS settings. DCS stands for Digital Code Squelch, which means in the simplest terms, mm, think of it as a two-way password, and you need the password to transmit and receive a signal. These are the more technical... Someone's trying to reach me. These are the more technical capabilities of radio and are definitely for a different video. When you get better with it, the radio has more advanced settings that are available. You can actually connect to your computer with a cable like this. This cable does not come with this kit. And using free software called Chirp to program the radio to look and work exactly the way you would like it to, this radio out of the box, as is, will do a pretty good job. Hmm. No one uses these things. Now, for the big difference. What separates the UV5G from the UV5G Pro, UV5G, UV5G Pro, it's simple. Because of its updates, the Pro version can now listen to what's called airband radio. These are frequencies that aircraft used to communicate. Here, check this out. So to show you how this actually works and that the radio is actually programmable to that level, I've actually come out to my local airport and I wanted to show you. So what I've done is I've actually gone to uh, a, a website called Sky Vector, which is completely free, and I've gotten the information that I need to listen to um, their AWOS. This is an automated weather, I think, operation system. I can't remember. It's automated weather something system. They have one, and this is the frequency that it's actually at right here. So you can listen to other ones in the area if you can get close enough to them but you know for instance this is wallops items i think this is tangier island and i don't know what w75 is it's probably just some marker in the middle of nowhere but you can get all the information that you need to use the uh the air frequencies uh and um from sky vector and the local airports in your area Automated weather observation 1640 Zulu weather wind 1.25-meter band. This was considered a lost band because people stopped using it in the 80s and UPS actually tried to take it over as well for their trucks. But it's coming back, so it will be good to be able to use it again. Lastly, this update 
contains the ability to listen to the 350 through 390 megahertz frequencies, which is kind of interesting because these frequencies are used for television broadcasting, cell phones, satellite communications including GPS, personal radio services including Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, as well as other walkie-talkies, cordless phones, and satellite phones. Okay, I hope this video was helpful and make sure to hit that thumbs up on the way out the door. And as usual, stay safe, have a great day, and I'll see you when I see you. Bye-bye.